news. You're welcome once again to British Ivy School e-learning platform. Today, I'll be taking you in three on numeracy, topic, addition, and subtraction. Addition and subtraction. First of all, we look at addition and inverse operation. What do I mean by inverse operation? Inverse operation simply means after adding, you check to know if your answer is correct. Okay? Let's take an example. I have 421 plus 223. 1 plus 3 is what? 4. 2 plus 2, 4. 4 plus 2, 6. So my answer here is 644. Now, what do I mean by inverse operation? I'll simply check if my answer is correct by using 644, which is my answer, to subtract any of these. Okay? Now I have 644 minus 223. Remember that I've always told you that the opposite of addition is subtraction. Okay? So I have 4 minus 3, 1. 4 minus 2, 2. 6 minus 2, 4. So you've seen that I've gotten back my 421. So when I, I can equally subtract, I can equally use 644 to subtract 421. If I do that, I should be getting 223 as my answer. Okay? That's just a simple way to check if what you've added, if your, um, if your calculation is correct. Alright, I have 510 plus 488. Let's solve this. 0 plus 8 is 8. 1 plus 8 is 9. 5 plus 4 9. Now, how do I check? I'll use my answer 998 minus 510. 8 minus 0, 8. 9 minus 1, 8. 9 minus 5, 4. So you've seen now I've gotten one of these um, answers. So this is correct. 604 plus 113. 4 plus 3, 7. 0 plus 1, 1. 6 plus 1, 7. Now to check, I will now do 717 minus, remember to check in addition you subtract, minus any of the numbers 113. 7 minus 3 is 4. 1 minus 1 is 0. 7 minus 1 is 6. So I've gotten back my answer. Please, whenever you check and you do not get back your um, any of the numbers that you used to add, just know that there is, you made a mistake somewhere. You need to go back to your calculations to add again. 0 plus 0 is 0. 0 plus 0 is 0. 
Now, to check using subtraction, please pay attention. To check using subtraction, you simply add one, your answer, with, with the lesser number. Your answer and the lesser number, that is the answer and the lesser number, this and this. Please do not add your answer with the bigger number that you use to subtract. Okay? Because in subtraction, the number on top is usually the higher figure. Okay? So I'm going to add these two to see if I will get 289. Okay? 5 plus 4 is 9. 4 plus 4 is 8. And 1 plus 1 is 2. So you can see I've gotten back my 289. Alright? Now, for this, 352 minus 211. 2 minus 1, 1. 5 remove 1, 4. 3 minus 2, 1. Now to check, I will use this one, this figure, and add with this. Okay? 211 plus 140. 1 plus 1, 2. 1 plus 4, 5. 1 plus 2. Three. So you can see that. Then finally, finally, let's subtract 599 minus 376. 9 minus 6 is 3. 9 minus 7 is 2. 5 minus 3 is 2. So my answer is 223. So I will add this with this figure. 6 plus 3, 9. 7 plus 2, 9. 3 plus 2, 5. So I've gotten back this particular higher number. Alright, so just know that in subtraction, to check, please, you simply add the two smaller figures to get your higher number, okay? The two smaller figures to get the bigger number. Alright, so do well to study this properly. I have a homework for you. Solve the following and use inverse operation to check. Solve the following and use inverse operation to check. So solve this in your notebook and submit to the school management. All right. Thank you very much for listening. Thank you very much for listening. Remember to stay safe. Bye.